All right, so I'm not going to use a selfie stick this time, right? But basically, this this Alexander Park's over there, right? They got this parade over here. Basically, what it is is from Claremont Road all the way across. The basically trucks, like people dancing in hollowed out <laughs> trucks. I, I thought it was going to be like a proper, like Brazilian level. I, I might have exaggerated in my mind, but I thought it was going to be like uh, like floats and then people dancing on the float. It's not. It's just random. Okay, it, it's unfair to make it sound like that, right? But they've obviously put a lot of work into it. They've done their routine very well. They, they wear their costumes. They've got the They've got their props, should we say, and basically they dance all the way from that street all the way across and then that way. Now, I went into the Park to get some food, right? And there was this, this stall with chicken on it. And I was like, uh, which one of these can I have? And they're like, oh, you can choose one of these two. So I chose the barbecue one. Cost me a fiver, right? And all I got... <laughs> A cold chicken leg. It didn't taste very nice. It had the skin on it as well. Maybe that's to be other people's liking, but for a fiver, I was expecting some rice, some veg, maybe. Not that I like veg, but I was expecting it, right? And maybe a drink. Maybe a drink would have been nice, but a fiver for one leg that was cold. And I, as I was walking towards the entrance, if you keep going that way, right, then you take a left into the park. You go into the park, and they've got this, like, section. I'm not going to go in. I'm just going to describe it. You've got this section. You go in, and then there's, like, this barricade, right? And you got to slowly walk through it. And it must be, like, a sort of security check or whatever. And all it is is a couple of fairground rides. I mean, listen, I'm not trying to sound disrespectful. Look how many people came out. It obviously means a lot to a lot of people. As you see, it's just basically random stalls with random stuff selling on it and people dancing in between. Okay, so very cynical view of the Manchester uh, parade, uh, the 50 year anniversary. I mean, people are literally lining the streets, right? They're lining the streets. And they want to get into the actual, uh, well, the carnival section. I'm not gonna go in because I'm afraid I'm not gonna come out. But I gotta do it kind of, kind of lackluster in my opinion. What I'm gonna do is it's a it's a 20 minute walk from here, so I'm probably gonna melt on the way. But I'm gonna walk up Claremont uh, Road because at the end it's uh, Windsor Road. Yeah, we'll go get some proper food from there. <laughs> Alright. Apologies to those who took offense to anything that I've said. I didn't mean it in that way. As I as I as I've said, look, you've got you've got a rich history. People coming out and then um, participating. Not for me, okay? So <laughs> I shall be here next year. It's like you know they have like those the stalls open for Eid and Ramadan. It's like yeah, it's just random stalls. It's like you can get a better collie at this point as well. So anyway, I'm getting I'm getting too uh, too emotional into this. This is the parade. Everybody's having fun. It's gonna go on until eight o'clock. Uh, people are gonna be dancing until eight. Um, yeah, those of you who came here and um, look like you're enjoying yourself. Hope you had fun. Uh, I apologize for the lack of entertainment in this particular video. I'm not. I'm not. It's literally the way. There's people wearing really revealing costumes, dancing around. That's all this is. I'll be honest. I'll be honest. That's all I saw. Anyway, like I said, not my scene. Uh, this has become a long video. We'll leave it at that. I'll catch you guys in the next one.